how are you? Yeah, I'm all right. Everything good? The family's good? You got married since I saw you last. That's right, Very a couple good. months ago, yeah. yeah. Congratulations. Thank you very much. No, it, it's a good thing. It is a good thing. To quote Martha Stewart. Um, <laughs> your, uh, you know, I read this thing about, about your wife. I don't know if this is true, but your wife, Mary Steenburgen, said somewhere that she can't go to sleep at night unless she watches Cheers. Yeah. Yeah, first, there, there's two rules. One is she goes to sleep first. Right. Uh, or else she stays up and wakes right. me up and I have to get back up. So she, she kind of snuggles in my arm and I, I, I prefer the History Channel myself. I like right. to see bridges being built and right, right. things like that. Constructive and, things. Yes. Civilization marching on. Yeah, yeah, I've seen the Golden Gate built about four times. <laughs> right, I, right. <laughs> it's my, that's my, but so she, she uh, watches me on Cheers and kind of cuddles me at the same time. It's this sense around kind of the whole thing. So, I would be weird. I mean, I would love the idea of watching myself while someone cuddled me. That's like <laughs> the ultimate narcissistic dream. It is. Do you ever, I mean, it must be. You caught me. Yeah, I was <laughs> yeah. making this her foible. It's yeah, really right. Mine. You're like, wake up, Mary, wake up. I'm on TV. Well, <laughs> That's, How about that's the real story. How about a miniseries, anything. Just a watch friend me. of mine actually once went over to Regis's house because yeah. he was going to visit uh, someone in Regis's family, <laughs> and he just wanted to say hi to Regis, and he ducked into the room, and it was while Millionaire was on, right. and Regis was watching <laughs> Millionaire, and the friend was like, "Hi," and he said, "Quiet, quiet," <laughs> <laughs> and he was literally like, "You know, I'm over there, and yet I'm here. I'm there, and I'm here." You know, he's like, "What?" Uh, but he's a wonderful man. He's a wonderful man. Cheers. I mean, I, I don't. There, people are constantly trying to come up with a show that was yeah. as successful and enduring as that show, and they they seem to come up with maybe one of those every 15 years or something. It was just so popular. What yeah. was that like when it when you first realized this it is was, it, this is becoming a craze? Yeah, this is becoming a mania. In the 80s, I was younger. Uh, it, was, it was it was rock and roll. It really was for a little while there. Right. It was. Uh, I remember the first uh, time it kind of hit me, we all got invited back to do something here in New York, some, you know, network shindig thing. Mm -hmm. And it was a huge building with a huge party and elevators and escalators. And it was my first kind of uh, groupie, you know, Sam Malone groupie. Just mm -hmm. thought I was, you know, God's gift to man. And she kind of followed me around and, uh, and it was quite charming, quite charming. Right. Then at one point in the evening, there was uh, she kind of lost. I lost her. She got lost or something. And and there was these escalators, one going up, one going down. And Cheers group was going up. And no, we were going down. And she was going up. And mm -hmm. as she she went, ooh, you know, saw me. And then as she got a little higher and saw the back of my head, she saw my ball spot. And she went, oh, burst my bubble. <laughs> And she was gone. I never had another what? groupie after that. That That's was my one and only groupie. <laughs> That's <laughs> terrible. <laughs> never take an elevator. No, no. Escalator. Never escalator, yeah, yeah. just walk. Uh, <laughs> you, uh, there are a lot of fans that probably assume that you are Sam Malone and, and that you're that guy, that you're that, that jockey kind of slick. Yeah. Character is that a problem for you? You must have a lot of fans that think that's who you are. Yeah, it makes Mary uh, have hysterics because I am, I am the, you know, most unhip man on the planet. I don't know anything about. No, sports. I beg to differ. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have, a we'll have this out later on. Right. The two of us running through a field. <laughs> See you. Ministry of silly walks. Yeah, yeah exactly. Right. But I've developed this kind of uh, in self-defense because you know, uh, I go into a bar, I go past the sports bar, or any kind of drinking festivity and a jock will go hey how about those da da da, -da? and i i or, sammy give me a hair. and i i've developed this generic kind of response it's a sound but it satisfies everybody i just go hey <laughs> <laughs> yeah. that works and it works it means that I, i'm with you you are <laughs> you are so right my friend <laughs> right uh, hey. that thing you just said that was so hey. right yeah we today we got a hold of uh, we got a hold of a family calendar that, that you and your family made up where, and it was, it's a nice idea. You wanted yeah. to make people laugh and, and, and yeah. so you had everyone in your family pose a different month doing some kind of interpretive dance. Now, this is Mary. This is the one who can't go to sleep. Right. This is Mary. She is the camp counselor. She, she gets us to do the crazy, really, you'll mm -hmm. see, insane things. But this year she decided the world needed to laugh, or our, our little world. Mm -hmm. And so, she decided to, to pose us all as Alvin Ailey wannabes, you right. know, little, and she got the little dance book, Modern Dance, out and assigned the poses. And uh, I am forever known now in my neck of the woods as Mr. July. 
Well, let's just take a look at this. This is nice. Look at this photo for July. I thought this was... <laughs> That's pretty impressive. Pretty impressive. Mm -hmm. First of all, hey. yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're not going to get those anymore. <laughs> those guys are not going to be like, oh. Uh, I couldn't do that. You'd have to saw my leg off and put it up here for oh, me to do, do that. You could do it. No, I mean, how do you, do you, do you yoga? How, uh, how do you get to No, be... that, you do that just once. Oh, just, you did that just, once. Just once. You heard and, a snapping and you retire. sound. Yes. Right. <laughs> you can literally, I mean, it's, you're yeah, up yeah. here. So, I mean, you're seeing unpleasant things. All right, I don't yeah, want to do that. Right.